the University of California, Davis, this is Newswatch. <laughs> Cece may look just like any other kitten, but she's not. Born earlier this year at Texas A&M University, Cece is a clone of her mother. In other words, she is genetically the same. Although several different species of animals have been cloned, the cloning of the cat is important. I work on inherited diseases in cats, and I work on those for two reasons. One, I'd like to cure cats and, and rid the cats of these uh, terrible inherited diseases, but also that information can be used uh, by human geneticists too to help cure the same type of disease in humans. Her genetics lab on the UC Davis campus focuses on the gene mapping of cats. Having the ability now to genetically create identical cats means lions can have consistent research results without having to worry about genetics genetic variables. Lyons says cloning does not mean that the exact behavioral and physical traits will be duplicated. Cloning allows us to have the same genetics, but we're definitely not going to have ever the same individuals. Cece doesn't much look like the cat she was born from. We can see that there's no orange pattern on CC, so that's very interesting for us that why is CC not expressing any orange, uh, which she should, but that also clearly uh, shows that some of the developmental color coat colors are not going to show through with a clone. A range of research efforts at the veterinary school are directed at finding cures for feline <laughs> blindness, kidney diseases, and cancers. Reporting from UC Davis, I'm Paul Fotenauer. Contact us at newswatch at ucdavis.edu.